So hi everyone, this is Jessica from the Achievement Squad, coming at you with a 100% achievement trophy walkthrough for Coffee Talk Episode 2, Hibiscus and Butterfly. So I'm going to issue a mild spoiler warning from this point onwards. We do not show you the full dialogue, however we do show you parts of the game uh, that carry spoilers. And there are several endings that we need to get in the game. So for each character there is a good ending and a bad ending. In some cases, some of the characters have two endings, so an additional ending that is good to get. Uh, and we're going to show you how to go about unlocking all of those, as well as unlocking all of the images that are in the gallery required for the achievements. There's also a secret ending that you get once you've completed all good and bad story arcs with inside the game. If you've played the previous game before, it is a case about making the correct coffee for the individual, or the wrong coffee if you're playing for the bad endings. There is an endless mode that is also on this game which requires you to make sure that you serve a large amount of coffees and teas within a specific period of time. So we're going to kickstart this off uh, and we're going to go straight in and create our name. And the first thing we're going to do is go into the options menu and we're going to set text speed to fast, uh, auto dialogue on and auto skipping on which allow us to hold down the right bumper to accelerate the text faster. That is just optional, you don't have to do that. If you want to see what the dialogue is about, I would strongly recommend taking the time, but this is a guide, so I'm trying to help you get through it as quickly as possible. Now we're going to kick this off by doing a bad playthrough. It takes me roughly three playthroughs of the game to get to the end. You're talking about one hour to complete a run of the game, roughly. So even though the video isn't as long, uh, but it's still going to take you some time. But you'll automatically get an achievement for kickstarting the game. Now I apologize for the dodgy clip here because I do actually in my video have the bad playthrough first but at any point in time you can select any chapter by clicking load game and you can pick the day that you want to reboot the game on. So we're going to kick start this off, we're going to go into day one. So as part of the bad playthrough our goal is to do the worst job possible. Uh, by serving everybody the wrong coffees, but this is a good opportunity for us to also get all of the named drinks out of the way. Now I've already run through the game, so when you see this, you'll see some drinks I've already uncovered, but down below in our description will be a recipe for every drink in the game. But to see what you've done, you want to press X, and that's going to bring up your phone. You're going to see the social media platform, and you are going to see the brew pad. In the brew pad system, you'll be able to pick the coffees that are particularly required. Sorry, see what coffees that need to be brewed. So right now I'm holding down the right bumper to go faster, but we now need to go about trashing a whole bunch of coffees. So there is an achievement for throwing away a grand total of 25 coffees. So we're pretty much just gonna make up a bunch of junk. Uh, in this case, I go about making a milk for the police officer because it's the polar opposite of what he's looking for. So by doing that, by selecting the milk three times, Once you have done that, you'll want to trash the coffee. So there's 25 coffees that need to be trashed for an achievement. Press B to do that. You get five mistake opportunities per day. And then beyond that, you do not get any more. So in this case, I'm just pumping through the five coffees that I need to trash. And now we actually need to serve him a drink because we cannot make any more mistakes to be thrown away. So we are just literally going to make him, again, the opposite of what he's asking for. At this point in time, where this is where you want to be serving up one of the named coffees. 
Uh, so take that opportunity to boo something up and give it to him. You must give the name coffee over for it to count. If you don't give over a named coffee, it will not count. So in this case I've opted for a cappuccino and we're going to now need to give him an item. To give an item you want to press X, pick it up with the right trigger or R2 and drag it with the left stick and then place it down on the tray and you want to give that over to the officer. Okay, once that is done, Lucas is going to join us. Uh, and there's going to be a bit of dialogue backwards and forwards between the officer and Lucas. And Lucas is going to ask you to make him a green tea. Again, pick something that is not a matcha green tea. Pick something else. Now he's going to grab a pap of the drink once it's been served, so he's going to grab a photograph of it and that's going to be an item that also makes its way across into your gallery. The gallery will naturally populate as you play through the game and some circumstances you may need to go onto things like the social media app or do specific things that don't align to the endings but I will guide you through how to get those. So push forward through this next set of dialogue until Riona joins us. So Riona is going to ask us to make a pea blue latte with art. So we want to pick anything but that. So in my case, I just go for three lots of milk, uh, which is not what she wants. So serve that up once it's done. So now there's going to be a lot of backwards and forwards dialogue between the uh, characters. In this scenario, um, I showed you the first day on purpose just so you get a bit of feel of how the game operates and kind of talks backwards and forwards with each other. However, I'm now going to just cut it down to only the points of doing coffee because or tea because the dialogue that is for you to go read and watch as you please. So just to keep the video short, otherwise we will be here for several hours.
So as you go through this game, you're going to be picking up items that people have left behind. Uh, we're not going to give any of them back in this playthrough because we're like that. Because uh, they do afflict the outcomes and the endings of the game. Now, next up, we are in day two and our friend Lucas has made his way back to the bar. Uh, we just need to give him something that is not a cafe latte with honey in it. Shortly after, some dialogue backwards and forwards with Lucas, you're going to be joined by Myrtle and Aqua. Myrtle is going to ask for a spiced milk tea, uh, so we're going to completely do the opposite. I pretty much go and focus on the coffees. Uh, if you guys want to along the side though, if you want to be copying what I'm doing, then that's completely fine because you will unlock the menu as you go. But like I said, the menu will be down in the description and the recipes on how to get there. You won't be able to get every drink on your first playthrough because some only lock with specific story events. Now shortly afterwards Myrtle is going to ask for a, another drink which is a spiced tea with a bit of cinnamon. Again pick something that is not a tea uh, and serve up the wrong business. Now at this point in time as well, I remember that you've got to scrap, as we said, 25 coffees. So just at this point in time, go about creating a bunch of nonsense and throwing it in the trash right until you run out of retry opportunities. And then once you're done, give Myrtle the wrong drink. We're now shipping over to day three. We're going to be joined by Lua and we're going to destroy her wedding by giving her the wrong drink. She wants a hibiscus drink with milk. Uh, so we're going to go down a different road and probably scrap a bunch of drinks in the process.
Next up, you're going to be joined by Amanda, Amanda the space person. They're asking for a blue drink with ginger. So serve up something with coffee, honey and cinnamon and you'll get the sugar and spice drink. Shortly after, we're going to be joined by Silver, who's going to want a floral drink. So we're going to make coffee, milk and cinnamon. And now we're going to go through into day four. We're going to be joined by Rachel. Now Rachel is going to want some form of non-coffee latte. Uh, so we're going to go for coffee, coffee and cinnamon, which is completely what she doesn't want. Uh, and shortly afterwards, we are going to be joined by Riona, which is the blue haired lady from the beginning. And she's after something that is sweet. So we're going to go for green tea, lemon and honey. And shortly after, we're going to be joined by Gala, who is going to be asking for his usual, uh, which is tea, milk and ginger. So we're going to give him something that he doesn't want. At this point in time as well, take the opportunity to scrap up another five coffees. So throw them in the trash before you serve them back to him. So now you'll see me pop the achievement for the 25 mistakes. That's because on previous playthroughs I'd screwed it up. And yeah, there we go. So I popped the achievement just there. But just remember as you're going through this playthrough, you need to keep making mistakes and making the wrong coffees for people. But keep throwing those coffees into the trash uh, as you're going through this. Now, if you've been following along at this point in time, uh, Riona is actually going to skip out of town on you. She's no longer going to return to the coffee shop. However, she'll make that pretty clear uh, as she's leaving and you'll get yourself the achievement or trophy called Ghosted. So next up, we are going to be joined by the police officer on the next day. Uh, and he's going to be asking for a black coffee. Uh, which is slightly sweetened so I'm going to give him a green tea with lots of mint and at this point in time if you're on a good playthrough you'd give him the lighter but in this scenario don't give him anything uh, because you'll get yourself an achievement for that one now you'll be talking to Hyde uh, and Hyde is going to ask you to create a drink but at this point in time you can never get a correct drink for Hyde so don't even worry about it just serve him up something uh, whatever that is is up to you Your next visitor is going to be Lucas uh, and he's going to join you and he's going to ask something that's like a pumpkin spice latte. Instead, I'm going to give him a glass of milk with a bit of lemon in it. And you're going to get something called Lamentful. And if you've been following along, this is the third drink that you've given to Lucas incorrectly and you're going to get the achievement bad review. So we are going into the next day now and Lua is going to ask you for a coffee with a bit of spice. Uh, I gave her milk, lemon and honey, or milk, help, milk, honey and lemon, giving her the lemony snippet, which is one of the named milk drinks. We're now going to switch over to Hyde, who's joined us a little bit later on, and he's going to ask you for a spicy red drink. Uh, in this case, he's getting milk, honey and mint, which is the another named drink called the Milky Way. And eventually you'll switch over to Bailey's uh, and he's asking for something with chocolate. Uh, so I'm giving him hibiscus, ginger and lemon. The next day we are only going to have to serve two drinks and that is the silver. I'm giving him a straight up tea. And there's going to be a lengthy cutscene between this point uh, and the next bout where he's going to ask for a second drink, which is something hot and sweet. So he gets a straight up matcha from me, which is bitter. We're now going to shift over to the next day uh, and we are going to be serving Gala again. And he's asking for something called a 
uh, STMJ or SMTJ, which is a milk drink. So give him something that doesn't contain any milk. I give him a detox tea. He needs it. Next customer is Jorge, uh, and he's going to ask for espresso. So don't pick anything related to coffee. Uh, and in this case, I go for chocolate, the ginger, and the cinnamon. Remember to keep trashing drinks if you haven't done it yet. We're now going over into the next day. Uh, and this is again Gala, and he's going to be asking for something with uh, no caffeine. So he's getting a cup of milk. And for Hyde, he's also getting a glass of milk. Remember to keep doing the named drinks if you haven't done them. Eventually you will run out of options. And then we're going to serve up Lua, and again I'm going to give her coffee. And on to the next day, we are going to be dealing with Jorge as our first customer. Uh, and we are going to be giving him a espresso after he asks for hibiscus, ginger and lemon. And then our next customer is going to be Lucas. So Lucas is going to ask for lemon green tea and ginger. Uh, he's not getting any of that. Next up, you're going to be serving Bailey's. Uh, and Bailey's is going to ask for hibiscus milk and honey drink. So just give him a straight coffee to fix that problem. And then Silver is going to be your next customer and they're going to ask for a short coffee drink. Don't give them an espresso like I nearly do, throw it away when it's done. But you'll also get this star-crossed siblings achievement at this time and this is for the bad story arc or the normal story arc with Silver and Amanda. You'll notice that Amanda is not present. Shifting over into our next day, we are going to be serving Aqua and then Aqua is going to ask for a cup of chai, uh, which is not coffee, so we're going to give her a coffee. And if you've been following along at this point in time, she'll confess that things are not great between her and Myrtle, so that's going to bag you another achievement for their life not going to plan because you can't serve coffee correctly. Shortly after Myrtle's departure, we are going to have another customer come in. And that is the guy from Monsters University. He's going to ask for STMJ, but just give him straight coffee. And he'll have been joined by Gala also. Uh, and Gala is going to ask you for a tea razal or something like that. So he's getting a coffee, which is not a tea. And now we're going to be in the next chapter and we'll be joined by Rachel and she'll have an achievement called Nothing to Show, which is where we failed to inspire her creativity. It's amazing how much of people's lives you can destroy with coffee and tea. And eventually she's going to ask for a milk, spice and honey drink. So she's getting an espresso. Everybody gets an espresso. And shortly after, Lucas will join in and he'll be asking for a latte. Just give him an espresso or any other named drink. And then we're moving on to the next day, which should have been Lua and Bailey's wedding day, but you screwed it up. So we want to give Hyde a, not a matcha, so he's getting an espresso. Your next customer is then going to be Bailey, uh, and then you'll want to give him anything but a herbal tea of his choosing. So another espresso, you'll get the achievement also for screwing over their wedding. And Gala, I don't believe at any point in time, orders anything from here. However, you should get Hyde's normal story arc achievement, Immutable Immortal. Shifting on to the next day, the police officer is going to be back and we want to give him just another espresso when he's asking for a sweet coffee. And you're going to get the achievement called Work Wells for fulfilling his normal story arc. Shortly afterwards, he's going to be joined by Freya. And Freya is one of the previous customers from the game. You want to give Freya uh, an espresso or a green tea in this case, not what she wants. 
So, and that's going to serve her the wrong drink. After you're done serving Freya, it's going to roll credits, uh, and you're going to unlock a whole bunch of the gallery art and everything there. Shortly after that, you're going to have another visitor come back in, and you're going to get the achievement Not So Hot Business, and that is for serving up all of the wrong coffees at the wrong place at the right time. We're now going to do a bit of mopping up on our achievements. You can level select by clicking load game and we want to load back into day number four. And you'll want to get to the point where you can serve Riona again. Serve her the wrong drink still. But at this point in time we want to give her the fidget spinner. So you want to go to give item, drag and drop the fidget spinner onto the tray. Uh, and that's going to lock an achievement for giving Riona the fidget spinner. Okay, so now we're going to do some more level selecting, but we're going to clean up some of the mistakes that we've made. We are going to try and save the wedding, and we're also going to get the good arc for Silver and Amanda. So to kickstart this, you want to load into day three. Uh, and Lua is going to be your first customer, and we want to give her a drink that satisfies her need, which is hibiscus, milk, and cinnamon. That'll turn over something called Pink Spice to her. Amanda's now going to join you and we want to give her Blue Lightning, which is Blue Pea and two lots of Ginger. Remember the order needs to be done correctly, otherwise these drinks do not count and you will get the drink called Blue Lightning. Shortly afterwards, Amanda is going to be joined by Silver. Silver is asking for something floral, which is Blue Pea, Honey and Mint. So next up we are going to need to load into day 6 which is with Bailey's, Lua and Hyde. We need to get Lua and Bailey's drink correct and Hyde's drink wrong. So Lua would like a strong coffee so we're going to give her two shots of coffee and ginger. For Hyde we just want to give him an espresso. Just anything that isn't what he's asking for. Because the goal here is to make the wedding happen. We want to serve that back to Hyde. And we're doing this to get a particular image in the gallery. Bailey's is your next customer. We want to give him chocolate, honey and milk. Okay, so we are now going to need to go into day number seven because we need to continue Silver and Amanda's arc. He's going to be asking for a strong coffee drink. You want to do two lots of coffee and lemon. That is going to be quite bitter and tart, as he so asks. And then there's going to be a bit of lengthy dialogue and eventually Silver is going to order a second drink, which is a hot sweet drink. So chocolate, honey and honey is going to answer that question. We're going to make our way over to day number nine now. So Garlo is your first customer and we want to give him blue tea, milk and ginger, which is the Gala tea. Your next customer is Hyde and we want to give him the wrong drink, so give him an espresso. You have to keep giving Hyde the wrong drink at these opportunities trying to destroy his career and then we're going to go over to Lua and Lua is going to ask for a lemon honey drink so I give chocolate honey and lemon you'll now need to load up day number 11 which is Bailey's Amanda and Silver who will be in attendance to the coffee shop Bailey is going to ask for a butterfly, butterfly pea or hibiscus drink. So it's hibiscus, milk and honey. Which if you do the hibiscus one is the same as the sweetheart latte. And then your next customer will be Amanda and we need to reuse any ingredient that we haven't given Amanda yet at this point in time. So in this case I go for hibiscus, milk 
and milk, which is not any of the ingredients we have given to Amanda currently so far in this storyline. That is going to give us the hibiscus latte. Now two things are going to happen at this point. You're going to get an achievement, which is uh, your how I met your ancestor, and you're going to get a wedding invitation also off of Bailey's, which will go into your draw. So that is one good story arc for Silver and Amanda, and a key piece for Bailey's good story arc. Silver's drink, we now need to give a hot chocolate with some sweet and spice, so chocolate, honey, and ginger will do exactly that for you. And now we need to level select into another day. Okay, so we're going to go into the last part of this one, which is day 14. Uh, and we need to serve up a hot chocolate drink to the crew. So we want to give them a hot chocolate with honey and mint. You need to ride this chapter all the way to the end to get a piece of artwork off of Hyde that you could not get on any other type of playthrough. We're now going to switch over to the good playthrough once this is done. So make your way to the end of this chapter and then you want to load up back into chapter one for another clean run of the game. So this time around, we are going to be doing everything right. We're back at the beginning and the police officer is asking for one of our drinks. We just want to give him three blue peas and that is the coffee he is looking for. Sorry, the tea that he's looking for. And as always, because this is the beginning of the game, we need to give Officer Jorge the card. So we want to press X and we want to grab the postcard and bring it down into the tray just here. Now we are going to be joined by Lucas shortly afterwards. You'll also get an achievement. Oh, well, I did here first brew, but you'd get that for your first drink that you serve in the game. This is my actual first playthrough. So now you're going to get Lucas. He's going to join you in the cafe, uh, and you want to give him three lots of green tea, which is a matcha. And then we're going to be joined by Riona shortly afterwards. Okay. So when Riona joins us, we want to give her a blue pea latte with art. So press on the blue peas, two lots of milk, and you want to give that a brew. And now we are actually required to do latte art. Now there is an achievement for spending one hour doing latte art. So to trigger that, you need to press Y when you're on this screen. Press right trigger to pour some milk. Uh, at this point in time for you guys, you can just pretty much stay on this screen for one hour and the achievement on trophy will eventually lock. You need to pour in a bit of milk first of all for it to count, but just do whatever you want. I left my computer idle to pop this achievement, uh, but it does take an hour to come through. Naturally, I'm not going to show you that in this video. So once you've done that, you're going to pop the achievement called It's a Masterpiece, uh, and that's for showing off the social media worthy drink. And our next customer is in the next day, it's Lucas, and we need to give him a coffee with honey and milk. So he's asking for a being busy, I believe it is called. And then shortly afterwards, you are going to be joined by Myrtle. So Myrtle is going to ask for a type of tea, so a spiced milk tea. So we want to give tea, milk, and we will do a bit of cinnamon. Uh, and I can't pronounce this, but I think it's like Shai Glagran or something. Shai Arden. Uh, yeah, probably screwed that up. Uh, straight away after serving Myrtle, you are going to be serving Aqua. So Aqua is going to ask you for a special type of drink for her. Uh, and that is quite simple. It is blue pea as the base and then two lots of mint. We're now going to be in day three and you'll be serving Lua and she's asking for hibiscus then with milk warm spice. So we want to pick the red plant, so hibiscus, milk and cinnamon uh, and that is going to give her the next drink. About to secure the wedding which is the pink spice latte which we gave her earlier. Serve that one up and then shortly afterwards you're going to be joined by Amanda who is your next customer. We need to give Amanda something called Blue Lightning, which is blue pea and two lots of ginger.
Next visitor is going to be Silver joining Amanda and Lua uh, and he's going to ask for something sweet and floral so we want to give blue pea, we want to do honey and then we want to do mint and that is going to be one of the flower bed teas I believe. We are now going over into day four and we're with Rachel. Uh, and this time around, we are going to serve her a non-caffeinated latte. So hibiscus, milk, and honey. Once we've given her that, we're actually going to turn over a bit of a gift to her. She's going to give it immediately back, but we want to give the item. and We're going to give her the fidget spinner. Sometimes items get on top of items in this drawer. It's a little bit weird. Um, so just move them around until you find it. The dragon drop that over and place it onto the tray. You'll get an achievement to serve that over to Rachel, uh, but she's going to give it back to you immediately. Next up, we are now going to be joined again by Riona, and she's asking for a blue latte with a hint of sweetness. So we want to do blue pea, we want to do milk, and we want to do honey. And that's going to be the dreaming piece. But we also need to serve up to her at the same time. We need to give her Lucas's contact details. So press X to bring up the give item menu and it is the little business card that's at the top. Don't confuse it with the ID. Place it onto the table and then serve that up to Riona. Going to set you up now for Gala. Gala is after a mix of tea. So we want to grab the tea leaves, milk and ginger. He pretty much writes out what he needs in the description, which is a Gala. Gala had. Now at the same time we want to give Gala the fidget spinner because there is an achievement called child's play because he will give it to the children at the hospital. How kind of him. So next up we are going to be in the next day and it is going to be Jorge and Hyde. Hyde will come in first but Jorge gets served first. He just wants a black coffee that slightly sweetens so two dots of coffee and honey that is going to give him what he's looking for. Now at this point in time we need to give him an item, give him the lighter that he forgot on his last visit. And that's going to leave us with a sweet coffee. We now need to serve up Hyde. You cannot get this drink right, whatever you do, so don't even try it. Just pick anything. In this case, three lots of hibiscus will do the trick or anything else. It doesn't really matter. So just give him something. Now, the important part with Hyde is that we actually give him the key card that Gala left behind because that belongs to Gala and getting in and out of his apartment. So even though you get the drink wrong, be sure to give him this card because it prevents him from getting a fine. Now our next visitor is gonna be Lucas. He's gonna ask for something like a pumpkin latte. We need to do coffee, milk, and cinnamon because you don't have pumpkin. Serve that up to him. Uh, and I've given him a cinnamon latte in this scenario. And if we've been doing good so far, uh, we should get an achievement at this point in time, which is the good review achievement. So next day, next customer it is Lua, and she's asking for a strong coffee with spice. So we do two shots of coffee. And we do a bit of ginger. Your next customer is going to be Hyde. We want to give him the hibiscus with two bouts of ginger. And that's going to pop you an achievement also for giving him the right drink, which is what we were supposed to serve him yesterday. 
Got a Zobo, but we didn't have any ginger to give that to him. Next up, we are going to be serving Bailey. Uh, and he's going to ask for hot chocolate with honey and milk. So just do as he says and it will give you exactly what he's looking for. Now moving swiftly on, our next customer is going to be Amanda and Silver. Uh, so we're going to give a bitter tart coffee, which is two lots of coffee and a slice of lemon. Turn that over. Uh, and you also want to give him the ID at this point in time. Because that is going to change the path that they're on for their game. So drop that onto the table. It's going to give us a different ending for Amanda uh, and Silver. There's going to be a bit of a long talk with the agent. You also bag an achievement at the same time called Master Perloinia, which is watch your pocket is the achievement. Once you've had your fun with the agent, he's going to order another a drink, which is a hot, sweet drink. So in this scenario, we go with chocolate and two lots of honey. Next up is our friend Gala in the next day. You're going to bag yourself an achievement for saving him $100 because he was able to get himself out of a fine of some form. Don't know what he's doing, but those plasters indicate violence. Um, so moving forward, he's going to ask for an STMJ. So you want to press milk. You want to again give him a douse of ginger and some honey. Our next customer through the door is going to be Riona, and we're going to be giving her a Russian tea, which is tea, lemon, and cinnamon. And next up, we are going to be joined by Horji, and we're going to give him an espresso, which is three lots of coffee, and then we need to give him back his lighter by pressing X. So when prompted, press the give item and return the lighter. And next up we have Lucas is our customer and he's asking for some spicy cocoa. So just pick the chocolate powder and we're gonna throw in milk and a bit of ginger. It's going to give him the Sahara drink. And then we're going to be asked one more time for another drink from Jorge. Uh, and that is going to be a red flower tea. So red flower with ginger and honey. And with one more order from Lucas, wants a blue pea, mint, and a splash of lemon. And over to the next day, we are joined by Gala and Hyde. The first drink is a Gala Hyde with no caffeine so we want to pick the blue pea we want the milk and then we want the ginger now we need to give Hyde a drink from the first game so we're going to give him two douses of coffee and some ginger that's a drink from the very first game that we have to add to this one. Uh, we could have given the other one from earlier in the game. Uh, however, we're going to go for an old school one because it changes the circumstances in the game.
Next in, we're gonna have Lua, and Lua is gonna be complaining about a sore throat, so we wanna go with a hot chocolate, lemon, and honey. up we are going to be on the next day serving Jorge and we're going to make him a magical drink which is coffee. I'm going to give him honey and we give him lemon and it truly is magical I mean I, yeah so magical and at the same time be sure to give him his lighter. Once you've done that you want to serve that up to him uh, and we're also going to get an achievement at this point of time for the hard boiled which is for some people to come and visit and have a quick discussion with him. Eventually our next guest is going to be Riona and she's going to be asking for tea infused with lemon and honey. So classic tea, lemon and honey. And going on to our next round, we are going to be helping out Bailey's with a hibiscus milk and honey drink. Pretty much says it in his statement at the top there. Uh, and that is going to kickstart some of the wedding stuff. We are going to be shortly joined by Amanda and Silver. And we're going to need to serve up their drinks. So we need to serve something we haven't given Amanda in the past. So it's hibiscus and milk milk again for the hibiscus latte. Now if everything has gone to plan and you've been following on correctly. You're going to bag yourself an achievement for uh, the number at the distance. Uh, I think it's a bit of an easter egg. I can't remember. But it's you know 40 odd thousand kilometers uh, and that's completing the last good story arc for the crew here. And you're also going to get the invitation for the wedding from Bailey's. Next up, Silver is going to ask you for a drink. And we're going to chef him up something real good. So we want hot chocolate with sweetness. So hot chocolate. And we want two honey and ginger. So over into our next day uh, and I'll be serving Aqua. You'll see me popping an achievement here that you won't get but it's for making a mistake. But we need to give her tea, ginger and cinnamon for a cup of chai. You should already have the mistake achievement at this point in time. So tea, ginger and cinnamon need to be given to Aqua. And it's going to give her a masala chai. And our next customer is going to be Hendry. Uh, he's going to come in with Gala. He's going to ask for an STMJ, which is milk, ginger, and honey. Next up, we are going to serve Gala for a drink we have served already in the past, which is hibiscus, ginger, and honey. Once you've done that and you've brewed that up, you're going to need to then also give over the wedding invite to Gala at the same time. This is just to make sure the wedding goes ahead properly. We now be joined by the police officer again and he's going to ask you for an espresso which is three lots of coffee nice and simple and at the same point in time we also need to give him the card from Riona so open up the drawer and drag and drop the blue little card onto the tray
and on to the next day. So Rachel's going to rejoin us and you're going to be bagging yourself some achievements at this point in time for getting her inspired for the Sweetheart Latte song. So that's going to pop you an achievement and then she's going to ask you for a glass of milk shortly after Riona disappears. And that is just three lots of milk in a glass. Next up, we are going to cheer up Riona and to make up for serving milk to the other person, we're going to make a sweet blueberry pie thing. So hibiscus, honey, and mint. Serve that up uh, and you want to give the blueberry pie with hibiscus and mint over to our friend here. This is the berry blue hibiscus pie. Skipping through into the next day. We are going to be joined by the crew after the wedding. We needed to serve up a hot chocolate with honey and mint. Uh, this is going to pop a couple of achievements. So this is going to give you the achievement for satisfying the couple of story arcs. Uh, so the drink we're giving up is a after midnight. So we're going to pop some G's here. Once everybody's at a swig of the coffee or the chocolate. And that is the achievement also for the just married story arc going to plan where they finally tied the knot and everything was done correctly. And also an achievement for completing Hyde's other story arc. Okay, so shifting over into the next day we are back with the police officer and he's going to ask you for the drink that you made the other day which is three lots of blue pea in our case turn that over to him and next up we are going to be joined by Lucas. He's going to ask for a blue pea latte. So blue pea, milk and milk. And you're going to put latte art on the top of this one. So press Y to trigger that and do a fancy pattern on the top of his drink. Shortly after, you're going to be joined by Riona, and Riona is going to ask for a mild coffee with honey. So it's one shot of coffee and two lots of honey. And if you've been following along, you're going to get two achievements now. The Hibiscus and Butterfly achievement, which says, does it make sense? And if you've been skipping through the text, the answer is no. And then you're going to bag yourself another achievement called Remembrance at the same time. And that's for completing other story arcs and never forgetting. That is the end of this good playthrough. Our last customer is going to be Freya. We want to give her three shots of coffee, so make her up an espresso. Uh, even though an espresso is a double shot of coffee uh, and it's going to be roll credits again but now we're going to have this kind of weird moment and I don't know why this happens but for me I have an empty chair with nobody in it uh, I can't quite figure it out but I serve up a matcha coffee to the empty chair it doesn't seem to do or change anything but serve up the uh, was it the green tea with two lots of milk the only reason why I do this is because one of the images in the art gallery has this as a scenario i don't know whether that's linked to the fact that we gave hide a drink from the first game or not however you can serve that one up there's nobody there though
Okay, we've got to go mopping up again now. So we want to load back into day number four. Uh, we're going to get the remaining of Rachel's achievements. So we need to give her a blue pea base drink with milk and honey. And that is going to give her the bee dreaming blue. So once you've chef that up, you want to turn that over to her to serve it up. And once you have done this, we want to then move over uh, back into a different chapter. So open up the chapter, select it again once you've given her the drink. And we're going to go into day 13, which is where she returns. And if you've done this correctly, you're going to bag yourself an achievement for give her the dreaming blue drink. Next up, we want to go back to day four and we're going to load back in and speak with Rachel again. And this time we're going to give her green tea. We want to give her some milk and we want to give her some honey. That is going to give her the green, see the, uh, the, the milk, honey, green tea. And you want to serve that up. And then we're going to load back into another chapter once we've served her that drink. So load up the load screen and we want to go across back into day 13 and you'll bag yourself another achievement for inspiring her again and then we want to make our way over into day four again we want to restart it we want to go back to Rachel we need to give her the hibiscus, milk, and honey based drink. Now we already made her this drink and already inspired her for this, but I don't know for some reason again the game doesn't recognize if we've done it or not for some reason. Uh, so serve her that up. Give her the fidget spinner if you want to at the same time. It doesn't really make much of a difference. But I've already got the achievement at this moment of time. But giving her the fidget spinner, just, you know, double down. Ship back over to date number 13. And then once you're back into day 13, you'll have the achievement for unlocking all three of her songs, which means you are a true fan. Congratulations. Now we need to press X to open up our phone and we're going to go through what is like their, effectively their Spotify. Uh, so don't press Y, press X. And when you go into this, go into the shuffled tool at the bottom. Uh, and you want to press Y to bring up the full list. And you want to play through every song on here. And that is going to bag you a song for uh, an achievement for listening to every song in the gallery. Okay, so we're now going to go through our next playthrough. So boot yourself back up into chapter one. It is a, another good playthrough, but with a slight tweak on this uh, so we can get different things rolling. So we're going to kick start this off by serving Jorge three blue pea teas, uh, and that's going to keep him happy. You will also be forced to give him the postcard at the same time. And then your next customer, Lucas, is going to pop in. I'm going to give him three lots of green tea for a matcha. So our next drink is for Riona and it is blue pea latte. So it's blue pea milk milk and be sure to do the latte art afterwards. And in this run, we're going to be checking the Tomada Chill 
social media website. So this is something that's pretty much in every single uh, day with different posts. You want to press X to bring up your phone, click on the application and you can see everybody's profiles from here. So quickly scan all the profiles and you need to check the stories. We need to check the stories day by day because they do add images to the art gallery. Okay, so next day and we're going to be serving Lucas first thing and he's going to ask for a cafe latte with lots of honey, which is coffee, honey and milk. Now you have myrtle to serve up, which is tea is the primary. And then you want milk and you want cinnamon. that you're going to need to serve your friend up a blue tea with two lots of mint before you close out day two be sure to open up your phone and look at the social media app Next round of stuff, we are going to be serving up some hibiscus with milk and a warm spice. So hibiscus, milk and cinnamon. And be sure to give some time after serving up this drink to checking the social media app again. Going to be visited by Amanda, and we want to do a blue pea with two lots of ginger. Once you've done that, Silver is going to join you, and you want to serve up blue pea with honey and mint. Head over into date number four and you want to open up the app and check social media yet again and you'll be shortly visited by Rachel. Give her a hibiscus latte with honey. So red honey, milk and honey. We now need to serve up to Riona a, a dream in blue, which is blue pea, milk and honey. And at this point in time, we would like to give her Lucas's contact details. Next visitor is going to be Gala. Gala is going to want it with tea, milk and ginger. in day five and we want to give a double shot of coffee and honey to the police officer and be sure at this point in time to return his lighter
And here's your gentle reminder to check your social media app for any additional pictures that are added. Next up you can save, hide anything and it makes no difference. We are now going to be briefly joined by Lucas, so straight after this, and he's going to ask for a pumpkin latte. So do coffee, milk and cinnamon. It's not a pumpkin latte, but it's the closest thing because it's the right spices, apparently. We are heading into the next day and we want to click on the Tomada Chill and check our stories. Once you're done with that, our first customer is going to make their way in the door and that is these guys. We want to start off with a coffee coffee and a cinnamon for Lua. Next up we'll be serving Hyde uh, and we'll be giving Hyde a different drink this time through. So hibiscus with ginger and ginger and we also want to give him Gala's key card. Next up, Bailey's is going to be looking for a hot chocolate drink, so we're going to give him hot chocolate with milk and honey. We just follow the instructions that he gives us here. And now we're going to boot up the social media app and scroll through all of the pictures. Next day, we are with Amanda and Silver again, and we're gonna kick this off with a bitter tart coffee drink. So two coffees and a lemon. And we wanna give over the key card at the same time. Once the battle is over with the agent, you will want then to serve a hot sweet drink, hot chocolate with double honey is the way to go forward. And then we're going to move on to the next day uh, and we are going to kick it off by looking at our social media app. Just remember to keep doing this every day. I'm going to keep reminding you as much as possible, but these are where you're going to find all of your pictures from. Our first customer is Gala. And he's after the STMJ combo, which is milk, ginger, and honey. Now we're gonna have Riona make a reappearance and we wanna give her tea, lemon and cinnamon for the Russian tea. Shortly afterwards, the friendly cop will join us. He wants an espresso with a lighter, so three coffees and then return the lighter. Shortly afterwards, Lucas is going to want some service. And we are going to give Lucas a hot chocolate with a spicy kick to it. So we're going to give him some ginger and milk. Milk and ginger for this one. That is the spice. The cop is going to want one more drink. He is going to ask for a hibiscus based drink with a touch of honey. So, and ginger. Hibiscus, ginger, and honey is what you need to put in.
And then the last part is to give a Galaxy Mint Tea over to Lucas. And that is a blue pea mint and honey lemon lemon blue tea blue pea mint and lemon also don't forget to check your social media app before the day is out and then moving on to the next day we want to boot up the tomajil social media app again we want to check to see if any new pictures have had it uh, been added and gala and hyde are going to join us for a, another brew We want to give blue pea milk and ginger across to Gala. And then for Hyde, we're going to make another Zobo, which is hibiscus and two lots of ginger. It's a different drink compared to last time. Soon we will be joined by Lua and she's going to ask for a something with lemon. I do green tea, lemon and honey in this scenario that gives us a cough syrup. Remember you can go back and make any of these drinks at any point in time if you're missing anything. The menu how to make things is down below in the description. Shifting on to the next day, be sure to boot up your social media app and check for new photos. And we're now going to be joined by the police officer to make the next magical drink. So this is pretty much straightforward. It is a coffee, honey and lemon drink. This is the magical one, which is swirlies on it. There's some proper voodoo stuff going down. Uh, be sure to give over the item before you proceed, which is the lighter. Uh, and then we are going to be joined by Riona. We want to give Riona with a tea, lemon, and honey. Next up, our friend Bailey is going to make an appearance, uh, and we're going to give him a drink with pea or hibiscus as the base with a bit of milk and honey. We're now joined by our favorite space ranger, Amanda, and we're going to give them some green tea, three lots of it. Doesn't really matter at this stage because we have Amanda's good and bad arc endings, so we're just getting a matcha, which still works out to be correct anyway. And next up we're serving silver, some hot chocolate with some honey and some ginger to give him the drink that is named after the speed of light. Uh, it's a new day and Aqua is going to join us and we need to give Aqua some chai, which is tea, ginger and cinnamon. Now be sure to boot up your social media app and doom scroll through these stories whilst you are joined from the guy from Monsters University. Who's Macapa? Uh, and then you want to put in a milk, ginger, and honey for him. And then we're going to shift over to Gala, and Gala needs some hibiscus, some ginger, and some honey. And at this point in time, you want to give him the wedding invitation. It's on the list. We'll then load in with the cop 
Uh, we want a straight up espresso, so three shots of coffee. And you'll want to give him the details from Riona. You'll be shortly joined by Rachel on the next day, asking for a warm cup of milk. Give her all three, uh, and then be sure to check through your social medias as well. We need to turn over some help to Riona. So we want to give her a blueberry pie, which is hibiscus, honey, and mint. As a gentle reminder, if you haven't done it, check your social media profiles. And now it's the day after the wedding day. We want to boot up our social media app and have a quick doom scroll through the stories just to see what we got going down here. And then next up on the list, we are going to have our friends come in. We want to make a hot chocolate with honey and mint. We are now scrolling into the next chapter. Uh, so the next day, boot up the social media app and check the stories and see if you've got any new pictures coming in. Uh, and then from here, we are going to serve up some drinks to our friend Jorge or Georgie. I don't really know if I've been saying it right, but I've been doing it for a while now. Give him three lots of blue pea. Next up, our nearest and dearest is going to be Lucas. Uh, and we're going to give him a blue pea latte, which is blue pea with two lots of milk. And we need to do art on the top, so be sure to press Y. And if you followed along, you should be starting to pop some achievements now. So we're going to have the local favorite, which is getting every drink right in the game, even though that we have not finished everything yet as it stands. Riona is going to pay you a visit and she wants a mild coffee with sweetened with lots of honey. So single shot of coffee and two lots of honey is going to do exactly that. And then once that part is over, Lucas is going to ask for a special drink, which is the last named drink I require in this, which is green tea, honey, and milk. That is the five star review. Uh, like I said, all recipes for special drinks will be below, but make sure that you do them after the game or during your bad playthrough. And then once you serve that up, you will get a achievement for serving the five stars review. Uh, and you passed the test. I also received the Master Brew achievement at this point in time. This is going to bag me the achievement that I was looking for for making all the coffees. It's not everything, but it is. Which makes no sense. And your friend Freya is going to be back in the room and you're going to need to serve Freya an espresso. Or espresso, no X in it. Okay, so we're going to go back and reshape some of the outcomes for this playthrough as well, just to clean up on some of those story endings. So you want to load up day number four, and we're going to go back and we're going to screw with Rachel's drink. Keep her out of the picture. This is so we can get some specific artwork. Talk to her. And then just serve her something. Just a bunch of hibiscus. Just make sure it's the wrong thing. Once we've done that, Riona will be in and we need to serve her the blue pea and milk and honey, the correct drink. 
or the Dreaming Blue. Be sure at this time to also pass over the contact details of Lucas. So, and you can do that via giving him the card. Once you've turned that over, serve it up to Riona. Now we're going to need to switch to a different point in the game again. So load this one up. We are going into day eight. And once we are in day eight, we're going to be joined by Gala. We want to give him the STMJ, which is the milk, ginger, and the honey. And then we need to serve Riona again. Just see what's a Russian tea, which is tea with lemon and cinnamon. And then we will be shortly rejoined by the cop and Lucas. We need to give Jorge the right one. He wants the strongest espresso with his lighter. So three shots of coffee and the lighter. Now we're going to intentionally serve the wrong drink to Lucas. So we're going to give him blue pea with mint and with lemon which is the opposite of something that is spicy and it's not cocoa that's for sure it's the galaxy blue mint tea and then we want to give another drink to Jorge which is hibiscus ginger and honey turn over another drink to Lucas which is blue pea mint and lemon it's the right drink this time. We need to skip forward to the last day, which is where everything closes out. But things are going to be slightly different because we screwed up one of those drinks for Lucas. It's going to be a different outcome. So it's going to kickstart with uh, our cop officer again, and we want to give him any of the drinks. I mean, I've given him three hibiscus here. I actually gave him three P last time. It makes no difference to the outcome at this point. You'll want to serve it to him. Uh, and then we're going to be joined by Lucas and Rioni. Riona. Once they're in, we're going to pick a blue pea latte with super cool art. So it's blue pea and two lots of milk. Okay, and now you are going to serve up the next stage of your drink, which is a coffee with two lots of honey that is for Riona. And if you've been following this part along, you'll bag yourself the achievement for a budding partnership. Now we have one more ending to target, which is the ta is the police officer, or he. But after serving Freya, of course, a, an espresso, 
but we want to jump in on day five and what we're going to do that's different here is we are not going to give Jorge his lighter back we are just going to give him the right drink which is two shots of coffee and some honey but do not give the lighter over Once that is over, we will ship out over into the last day again because now that chain of effect has taken the lighter away from Jorge and it's going to give him a different ending. So once you've pushed through into this, and we're in the next day, he will come in. You just need to serve him up the right drink as usual. So it's the drink that you gave him in the beginning. In my case, I gave him three blue peas. So turn that over. Uh, and he's going to vent his woes to you and you'll bag yourself the achievement for his story arc. Next up is Freya. You want to give her an espresso, which is three shots of coffee, and then it's going to roll credits. Now, if you've been playing along and you've got everything along the way so far, you're going to get something called Art Connoisseur during this stage, which is the collection of the artwork so far today. Once you've done that, you'll then be taken through to a hidden ending because we've now found all of the secret endings in the game. And this is a tribute to one of the late members of the team, but the coffee talk. So that is then going to spawn you into kind of a post scene. Farming's going to be there and you need to give him green tea with two lots of milk. And you'll bag yourself for the achievement for identifying the owner of the cat. I like the little Easter egg where he's got a VV in his top left hand pocket as well. So once this is all done, we're now going to shift over into the endless mode. Okay, so for endless mode, you're going to need to serve 50 coffees within the challenge mode uh, and it's on a timer. It's basically just pump out as much coffee as possible in a short space of time. So pro tip on this one, pausing is going to save you a hell of a lot of hassle as you're going through this. Uh, you can get to the endless mode through the main menu, but what happens is when you boot it up, you'll be in a position where you'll receive an order and you need to make it. So we've got a green tea, lemon, and would be nice. So green, green tea and lemon, so it's a lemon green tea. Effectively, we need to go through and make 50 of the orders that they put on the table to you. Just follow the instructions on the screen, but you can pause if you need to at any point in time to find the right recipe you know if you've done it correctly because you get a little smiley kind of piece on the screen the order of this is completely random so i mean you can try to follow along i don't know if it's perfect or not but just pause if you get stuck look at the description if you're looking for something specific where they're using the name of the product or the drink that it is but just copy along with this i'm not going to narrate the whole thing because it would be completely pointless but effectively, endless mode, you're on a timer, go as quickly as you can. You'll get a little bonus for every drink that you complete successfully uh, and just keep at it. But remember to pause if you get stuck. 
So you should be pretty much on top of things. You might be missing the achievement for the cafe latte art or needing to clean up on anything. For the cafe latte art, go back into the game, make any latte coffee and you can sit on the art making screen for one hour. Just remember to pour a bit of milk into the drink first of all for it to work effectively. Uh, and then you may be missing some of the items that are linked to the special coffees that you've got to do. Again, just go back into the game and look at the description of this video and you'll see the full menu of drinks and how to make them. I've been Jurassic Edward from Achievement Squad. If you find this guide useful, drop us a like, comment, subscribe and happy hunting. Thank you.